Hi and welcome. Please stay still for the yearbook photo, sir. Dimensional Key Studios. This is his studio, Dimensional Key. That's a great transition from one graphic to the other, also, by the way. It's a 3D action adventure game for Android tablets and mobile devices. It is the third. How Android tablets and mobile devices? Comical violence. Take two. Our game is called DKS's Reality Death Maze. This is a game show in which you play a prisoner who gets a chance at. Next, he's going to be bending over a stool, looking at the camera all sexy like. Survive a maze of death traps. In the game, you start off with five. This is originally a vanity novel I wrote, but. Wow. Number one didn't want to make it. There are four areas to explore a dark cave, a frozen pass. Actual final product. Three levels of difficulty. Easy, hard, <laughs> Where's medium, wait. you fool? To keep things How do you go from this poser, like, 3D modeling hard. shit to that crayon <laughs> drawing <laughs> stuff? Well, his child helped him develop the game, obviously. Oh. In the prototype, you will get a basic idea of what the game looks like. Oh, I think we've already got the basic idea. <laughs> Yeah, um... Okay, the game looks nice and impossible. Right. Completely not that fun. Oh. I think this is my better side. <laughs> that's a funny... That's a hysterical death animation right there. What? <laughs> Your reward is a bingo card? Is that what that even was? I don't know. That's incredible. All right, um... I feel so bad that he didn't make his goal of $65,000. Hey, I'm surprised you didn't ask for more with all the time you took into those concept art. That's... Pieces. Incredible. Uh, all the graphics here are awesome. I, I really like the one with the guy in the red shirt. Yeah. <laughs> kind of ripped up. <laughs> and he... And... It looks like his hand's supposed to be running, rubbing his stomach, but I think his hand is on his arm wrong. So, <laughs> it's actually... It's like he's touching his wound and offering a high five, handshake or something. To... <laughs> it, it's like he has two right hands, if you if you really look yeah. at it, but... Also a really huge bicep. Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, he worked out <laughs> with yeah. that one extra right hand of his, <laughs> you know? Goddamn... I don't even know what to say. In the background, I know that's supposed to be a hallway, but it looks like just like a UFO chandelier kind of thing. Is this supposed to be a Simpsons video game? Oh my god. Uh, for tw oh, by the way, um... <laughs> I love this! $15 or more, okay? Okay. Uh, do you feel sympathy for the prisoners? <laughs> you, you, you won't feel that for these prisoners. Oh, wait, huh? You'll receive the digital 3D models of the characters and their background information. See what they look like and know what they did. You'll really laugh at their funny death animations when you hate their guts. <laughs> for $15. You realized how many families they killed. <laughs> for $15, lose your empathy. <laughs> Um, what the hell? Wait a minute, for $25, do you want to find more of the backstory behind this game? You'll receive a spe no. special edition digital comic. This is the only place you can get it. Damn. 35 bucks, uh, everywhere you go, show your support for your favorite new game show. You will receive an amazingly awesome keychain. And then for $50, apparently you have to do something once you get $50. Show your love for Reality Death Maze. <laughs> you won't even have to say anything. Talk about cool. You will receive a specially designed t-shirt and poster. <laughs> this is incredible. Get a, what do you think the calendar looks like that you get for $65 or more? That's a good deal, <laughs> well, isn't it? You know how most calendars are at least $100? Hopefully he takes more pictures of those good-looking prisoners. <laughs> Who I hate. <laughs> Okay, risks and challenges. Um, oh boy. <laughs> production, production delays, personnel injury, huh? and hardware failure. Why would the staff making a video game be injured? Because they have to actually execute those funny deaths to get them programmed. It's motion capture. Like, I understand people on your staff can be sick or injured, but that is such a weird thing to call out. <laughs> I could be hit by a bus tomorrow. That's a risk of the project. Now, they'll avoid that, though, as long as they have the clean and focused work environment that the money will help pay for. <laughs> I really trust a guy to hyphenate software like that. <laughs> My software. My God. 
if Dimensional Key Studio reached hundred twenty thousand dollars, will make the much anticipated second and much anticipated second installment free to all our backers, including a much requested multiplayer feature. Much requested by who? Hell, no one's heard of this. <laughs> God damn! Wow. I uh, I almost feel bad. I noticed for seven hundred fifty dollars or more. By the way, you could give the characters new clothes. Like, really? Nearly a grand? Wait, can I just point out one last thing in the backers that we missed? For $1,000, right? You can put a character in the game. But then he calls out, includes all rewards except for 750 Which is designing clothes. Like, the dude gave you $1,000, man. Let him design a fucking outfit for your video game, too. Like, no, 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 that's, that's too much. For $750, you can do some work for us. <laughs> I gave you a thousand, can I do it? No, are you crazy? The character alone is worth too much. Someone actually pledged a thousand dollars. Uh, I have a feeling that's the creator. Hmm. Uh, they do that, you know. They're like, um, oh, what do you know? A thousand bucks, so I know it's not a dead project. I guess I'll fund it kind of thing. I mean, I'm not saying that's for sure what happened here, but that is for sure what happened yeah, here. Yeah, right. I ha to finish this project, I foresee a six-month schedule to fully develop this game, which includes four levels and progressive difficulty. $65,000 for four levels? <laughs> but then, of course, you got to think about building each level, which includes the level, <laughs> the death traps, the intro and in in ending, the rewards, and the characters. Coding and testing. Do you think these people, like, uh, like meet a game designer in a bar... And the guy is just very briefly like, I, I don't know, man, you need to build a level, code it, test it. And the guy writes it on a cocktail napkin. I like, got my Kickstarter. <laughs> just got to remember to design the level when I build the level. Oh, sorry. Uh, what's the name of this terrible thing again? Death Maze. Yep, Reality Death Maze. Next time. There wasn't much of a maze, though, was there? I mean, there was a lot of death, but it was kind of a linear path of death. Uh, maybe if they'd made their funding. Oh, okay, yeah, that's right. <laughs> they do have to design the level.